Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Is my camera straight? Good, I don't know. Sorry if you guys are slanted. My tripod is a little wonky right now, but I am looking to buy another one. So it'll be fixed, but right now it's a little weird. So if this isn't straight, I'm sorry, you're going to have to watch me slanted for however long this video is. I am just so, like, shook at this brand. I can't believe it. Like, I literally cannot believe this brand. Wait till I tell you guys. Basically, what happened was I was on Instagram just looking at, like, athleisure clothes and all of that. And I stumbled upon this Instagram page. I will have the page. I'm going to scoot over for a bit. So, I'll have the page on the screen so you can go and check it out. You can see what I'm talking about. But I stumbled upon them and I went on their website and I started scrolling through. And then I was like, wow, they have really cute things. Like, I love sports bras that have like little details at the back like i love a simple like front but then when you turn around it's like all fancy and like strappy and all cute like that so that's what i like and this website had that and i was like oh wow and then their pants looked like a line pants and i was like okay we need to test this out because they are cheap first of all they are such a reasonable price i want to say they're like half of what Lululemon charges, maybe even a little bit less than half of what Lululemon charges. They look really pretty and the colors are so pretty as well. So I was like, okay, we need to test this out. So I went on Instagram and I DM'd them and I just shot some DMs back and forth and then we came to an agreement that they would send me some things and I would be able to give an honest review for you guys because yes, I know things online can look really pretty. Instagram boutiques, Instagram clothing brands, Instagram everything. Everything you see on Instagram is like saturated, it's over the top, it's made to look perfect and pretty and blah 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 but we all know with experiences. Things can look pretty online, but you get them and they are <laughs> So, we are here to discuss mooses only, muses only, muses only. I don't know how to say it. I'm so sorry, guys. So, I do have a promo code for you guys. AA space 10. So, you have to do the space or it won't work. So, I'll have it on the screen so you can do it. It'll also be linked in the description. So, we'll talk well. about the first thing. This was the thing that truly caught my attention. So, this is a sports bra. It is a long sports bra, which I am such a fan of because I love long sports bras. So, I don't really like the ones that are short. I've said this a million times in like any of my Lulu vlogs, any of like my workout clothes hauls. Like, I love long ones that look just like this, like a little bit higher than your belly button. Look at the back. Look at this. This is the most interesting sports bra I have ever seen. Like, I love the detail. Like, I can't believe, like, it's different here and then it just goes different to strappy. Like, I can't believe this sports bra. Like, I love it and they have it in multiple colors. I got this guy in a small. It is super stretchy. I love the way that it fits. And small was definitely my size. So I am in between extra small and small. Some of them I do have extra small stuff and I do have small stuff because I wasn't sure. It was my first time purchasing from them, first time getting anything from them. So I was like, I'm going to test out both sizes so I can give you guys an accurate size up or size down. But for this one, I really like the size small because it is not too restricting. It's not too tight. It is still form-fitting. Like, it still hugs your body very well. It is super flattering as well, but there's no, like, spillage because, like, you don't spill out of it. It's not like sucking even like crazy. So I would say stick to a small. If you are in between sizes, go for the size higher. It is super high support as well. As you can see, the neckline is very supportive to your chest area. So there will be no spillage. I wore this for a leg day and then also on a back and shoulders day. And I just felt so comfortable in it. The material as well is so good. So it is double lined. Let me see if I can pull it so you can see it. It is double lined. The material is so soft. It's like everything here is basically between a line pants and wonder unders. So they are super comfortable, like a line pants. They are super flattering as well, but they are a little more thicker, kind of leaning towards wonder unders, but right in the middle. So it's not as delicate as the lines, but it's not too like rough and dense as wonder unders, which I don't like wonder unders. I love a lines. But these sit right in the middle and it's exactly what, it's like perfect because it's not as delicate as the Align Pants, 
but not as thick and weird that I feel the Wonder Unders are. Sports bra number two that I got is this Gemini Dual Roll Tank in Mink Ash. I got this one in an extra small. I feel like I don't have a preference if I had the extra small, but I also wouldn't mind the small. Like, it's not that tight. Like, it still stretches out. And then the back, again, has these nice little cute straps. And their logo is so subtle as well. So this is the logo that they have on like everything. Which I personally don't mind it. It's not huge. It's not like the Gymshark one that'll be like big or like all across the back. It's very like subtle in the corner. You can't even like see it. And I picked it because I'm a Gemini. So I had to pick up a Gemini dedicated sports bra. Next. Okay, so I had mixed feelings about this one. First of all, look how cool the design is. It's like a ribbed but then it also has like this, which is kind of like boob outline pads. And then it is longer. And at the back, surprise, surprise, we have another strappy sports bra. Now this one, at first when I tried it, it was an extra small. And I was like, I should have sized up to a small. But I actually went to work out in this. And I loved the support that it gave me. I was doing leg day, actually. And I felt like it was just secure. Like, it was secured everything. Nothing was going to, like, escape or anything. So I actually grew to really like the extra small. Just because it is more on the tighter side. But if you don't want them too, too tight, definitely go for a size small. I still could wear either or. But I actually prefer the extra small, you know, it gives you that extra volume, but it also has the support. And I am super into the whole, like, ribbed effect that it has, like, the material of it. It's also very soft. Well, the inside doesn't have that same design. It's more softer, comfortable. I just love the way that these feel. They are so comfortable, guys. Like, leisure. So these ones I picked out, I saw them on the website. And look how cute these sweatpants are. Are. They're more like jogger type, so they're not super baggy. I originally almost got them in a medium because when I was on the website, I looked at reviews and some girl, she I think she had the same size, like she was the same measurements as I was or like around there. And she said she got a medium. She posted a picture in it and they looked pretty tight still. And so I was like, okay, I'm going to get a medium. But last minute, they messaged me before they shipped out my items just to confirm everything. And they were like, okay, so you want extra small pants but medium in the joggers. And last minute, I was like, let's go for a small. So I got them in a small, and I'm so glad I did. Extra small would have been way too tight. Small was perfect. Medium is just going to give you, like, the baggier effect. So if you want more baggy, then go for the medium. But yeah, I'm usually extra small, small, go for a small. It was perfect. So it has two gigantic pockets at the front. The only thing is this little seam. And I feel like the front does kind of accentuates. It doesn't give you like full on like camel toe. But I feel like it does kind of hug that area a little more than I would like. But it does also probably because I yank it up a lot. Like I like my stuff high waisted. Oh, I just literally can't rave. I wish I could show you guys some way the material so you guys could just feel it and just it's so comfortable i love it the color's really pretty and are you ready for this guys are you freaking ready for this it has the freaking v that aligns have so if you don't know aligns at the back have like a little v shape to make your butt look good i have the align jogger somewhere and they are identical to this and then they just have their little logo at the back these are not sheer but the waistband is double lined, but I just love the way that these fit. And I know I keep saying that for everything, but guys, trust me. If you want to buy something from Lululemon, trust me, you can buy something from these guys for half the price. And you are still going to get such good quality. It's not going to be like 100% the same, but the quality is going to be there. Just don't yank it up as much and you'll be fine. Now, ladies and gentlemen. I give you their freaking amazing leggings. So these leggings also, as you can see, have that little triangle V shape that I was talking about. Logo yet again. Guys, you cannot tell me that these don't look like a lines. Like just take away the little logo, even from the back. Like you cannot tell me that these are not aligned pants. So they are thicker, like I said, but they're still very, like, elastic-y, but so soft. 
but not too thick because your girl doesn't like a thick legging these are thin but not sheer so they are thin but they are not sheer so you can go ahead and work out with this i would recommend though doing like a nudish underwear because i haven't tested them with like a black or like a red like a loud color so obviously wear like neutral colors and you'll be fine i haven't tested it out with black but i feel like it would be fine but just in case stick two more neutral this are the lululemons obviously literally the same and i know i'm yelling i'm trying not to yell but like they're literally like the same you guys look at this look at the color and everything so this one is more of a like bluish tone and this has more of a purpley tone gray tone but these are them side by side so they are still super high-waisted and they're basically just like that much different so the lines are a little bit longer but these are the 25 inch but see the lines are already my line pants are pilling so bad like look at that and I take care of my line these I can tell you like they're gonna last longer because of the material they're more of like an elastic -y, stretchy material I'll try both of them on and you guys will see how similar they are to another so those ones were in the turtle dove gray and these are in the pale lilac they are both extra small and this is what the tag looks like I took the tags off of everything else because I've already worn everything else but these ones, I haven't taken off the tag off. I haven't worn them just yet. I've talked about other brands like Queenie Key. There's like Buff Bunny, Alpha Elite. There's so many brands out there like Gymshark. But I'm telling you guys right now, these are the most similar to aligns that I have found. And they are such an affordable price. I can't stress that enough. Plus, you get 10% off if you use my code. So these are the aligns. These ones are a little more like darker purple deeper purple where these are more bright and out there purple but like come on guys you can't tell me these are not similar especially because they have that v what sold me on these leggings was that v because i absolutely love the v i think it accentuates the booty area so well it helps it pop like it's just it's so flattering and so when i saw those leggings i was like i definitely need to try these and they don't give you camel toe they are high rise like there's just i can't say enough good things about this brand and i'm not just saying that because they sent it to me because they wanted to partner with me we had an agreement that said that i could be a hundred percent honest and this is my honest opinion cute outfits motivate you to go to the gym that's a tip i have their instagram is muses only underscore yoga i personally didn't wear them to yoga i don't do yoga i do more like weightlifting and i wear these to weightlifting and they were good the only thing that i will mention that i forgot you do have to pull them up a little bit but nothing crazy like i wasn't yanking them like every five seconds like they do stay up i noticed that i yanked these guys up more than i typically yank up like my alliance or like tug at my alliance so that is another thing to keep in mind but like for the price check out their instagram page everything will be in the description as i mentioned my code my sizes the colors the links Everything will be in the description, so go ahead and click the description. More info and everything will be there. I got you guys. Don't worry. My experience went super well. Their customer service was really good. They were really nice to me, and yeah. I literally have nothing but good things to say about their customer service and how the whole shipping process went and all of that. They did send it priority mail, so they shipped it out, and it was like at my house like three days later. But that is also why I think I got customs, because it shipped with DHL, and I know DHL... I like 90% of the time get customs when they ship with DHL so I think that's why I got customs because they literally just sent it out and then in like three days the mailman was locked and like here's your package and I was like what like I got that so fast three days but yeah guys that is everything that I have to say thank you guys so much for watching hit the subscribe button if you are not already subscribed don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next one bye